Bryce, player always wants to get his first hit of the season out of the way. Your first hit, a 465-foot home run, your second longest since 2015. What did you like best about it? Uh, I mean, you know, personally, what a great game, you know, for myself today. But, you know, as a team, I mean, unbelievable. I mean, uh, uh, you know, Real Muto get his homer out of the way. Franco, I mean, great homer by him. Piff came out, threw the ball well. Uh, bullpen came in, threw the ball well. And, uh, you know, we got another dub. So, personally, you know, what a homer. Uh, a lot of, you know, a lot of excitement right there. Uh, coming out, curtain call, things like that. But uh, as a team, I mean, wow, unbelievable. Hey, you only played nine games in spring training. Has it been difficult to find your rhythm? Uh, I just got to get my timing. You know, that's about it. Um, you know, new ballpark, new back spot, you know, things like that. But, uh, you know, just try to come out and, you know, have good games. And as long as we're winning, you know, that's all that matters. So, uh, you know, very excited for this team, very excited for this club. We've got a great group of guys that are pulling for each other each and every night. And, uh, you know, another, another great team win tonight. You've played only two games here, and yet – You've established an incredible connection with the fans. The curtain calls, the bows in right field. What has this reception meant to you? Man, they're, they're blue collars it gets. You know what I'm saying? They work hard. They understand what it is to work hard. They want their players to work hard for them. And, you know, that's what it's all about. You know, they want us to hustle. They want us to play hard. And uh, you want to give them that every single night. You know, i got chills thinking about it right now. You know, it's, it's a great, great fan base, great city, great group of guys in here that are pulling for each other each and every day. And uh, if we can, you know, prolong this all year long and do our thing, uh, play good baseball and uh, you know, do what we need to do, then we'll be okay. Bryce, thanks very much. JT, two-run homer in the fifth made it 6-3. But I think I have to ask you, which was more fun, your home run or Bryce's? Oh, that's a tough question. Uh, I mean, this place was rocking for both of them. It's, it's obviously fun to hit home run, but it's, it's just as exciting to watch him hit his first homer here and the, the way the crowd reacted to it and him getting the curtain call. I mean, couldn't draw it up any better than that. Now, people forget you were part of some pretty good lineups in Miami, Yelich and Stanton and Azuna. What impresses you most about this lineup? I just think how deep it is. I mean, one through eight, there's really no holes. I mean, we might have the most powerful right now, the most powerful eight hole in the league, in my opinion. So, and then you got a guy at seven that gets on base all the stinking time. So it's, it's just a tough lineup. And it's, it'll, it'll really wear down a pitching staff and wear down an opposing ball club having to go through lineups like that and not having any holes in it. Now, the one thing you definitely didn't have in Miami is the electricity in this ballpark. For a player, what is the difference competing in an atmosphere like this? I mean, the difference is huge. Uh, just getting to come out here where the fans are so excited to watch the game and they're cheering you on the whole time. Uh, gives you a certain adrenaline that you can't get other places, and it just makes you play that much harder and have that much more fun. So I mean, these fans mean everything to me, and they've been super welcoming so far, so it's been great. JT, thanks very much.